just keep it going for 500 laps a day, they sure got a shot because Dale and that car seem to be matched perfectly this afternoon. By the way, just to, as an update, Dale Earnhardt will... Oh, oh it's a crash coming out of turn number two again. This time it's Bill Elliott slamming the inside wall. So turn two has been very treacherous for some of the drivers. We have seen already three spins in the first 47 laps of this race. First by Ernie Irvin, then Dale Earnhardt, and now Bill Elliott. And I think once again that Elliott has escaped being lapped by the leader, and Ernie Irvin was able to get one of his laps back. I think he was about three down, now he's two down. And we will be seeing some pit stops now as we take a look at, once again, how Bill Elliott got in trouble again off the second corner. I don't know if there's something over there or Bill was tapped coming off the corner. Wow. Jeff Bodine, the leader is in. Dick Bergeron is right there. It's going to be a four tire change and they're going to try to take some of the loose out of this car. He has radioed to his crew and said it's a bit loose. They're not going to touch the bolt. They're going to do it with stagger. Bias fly tires. See you again. Great stop by Bodine. He beats everybody out. Mark Martin is second. Waltrip is third out. That's the way they'll line up for the green flag run. Jerry? Bill Elliott has brought his course for the rest of the run, but the car was wobbling back and forth. We are told that the rear track bar, Pennard bar, has been broken in the car, and the rear end is shuffling back and forth in the car. That's why he had trouble even making a lap, even under speed, like 35, 40 miles an hour to get back to pit road. The field now passing by and sits on pit road. They have a whole lot of work to do here, Mike Beam and the crew, to get this car back in racing trim. Yeah, he stood on the accelerator as he moved away from the back stretch, and the car was very difficult to uh, handle. And now here is a replay from Michael Waltrip's vantage point once again. We're inside Michael's car. He runs up behind Ken Schrader in the Kodak Chevrolet, and Bill Elliott is already, ooh, and Schrader and Michael Waltrip get together trying to stop. Michael appeared to brush the outside wall as he tried to avoid the spinning Bill Elliott, and it appears as if Elliott may be pulling behind the wall. We'll have an update on that in just a moment.